happy Friday. I hope you've had a great week, and whatever your weekend may look like, whether it's one of rest and relaxation or one of busyness and getting things done, uh, may it just be a time filled with the fullness uh, of God that you would uh, be able to experience his presence and his love in your life. This morning I'm thinking about the topic of faith, and particularly the, the wise men um, and the faith that they had, that their efforts, their labor, their journey was not in vain. They had studied for years, looked at the stars, had known the prophecies and, and the words that were promised of, of how they would know when the, the king of Israel would be born. They knew where to find the baby, they knew where to go to get the answers they needed, but they still needed that faith to step out and to go upon the journey to discover the king. That faith was not a stationary one. They didn't just believe that it was the star and move on with their lives. They believed and then they had faith to step out and to go on a journey that would cost them time, money, energy, and even a little bit of risk. And yet they had that faith that what they saw was real, genuine, and true. They took that step forward to make their faith a reality when they got to experience the wonder of meeting the Christ and of presenting him with gifts. Today, as we're in the midst of the Christmas season, what steps of faith is God calling you to make? What ways can you step into the challenges, the apprehension, the uncertainty, the concern, but as well as the opportunities and the, the unique ways in which we can be the church, we can be the hands and feet of Jesus this Christmas season. What ways are you hearing God prompting you in your heart to have faith so that his light may show through in our lives? I hope you have a great week. This will be the last video of the week. Tune in again on Monday as we'll be exploring the second Advent theme of peace. Have a great day.